and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I am going to be teaching you how to download and install custom maps in Minecraft 1.15.2. We're going to be going over every single step of getting custom maps in 1.15.2 from downloading your custom maps and getting them there to getting them installed and added to Minecraft and how to make sure you extract the files correctly. All of that is going to be covered in depth in this video. First and foremost though, we do have a more sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. You can share Apex at the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Get an incredible 24-hour DNOS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. We actually love Apex so much that we host our own server, play.breakdowncraft.com on them. And guess what? All of the custom maps that are going to be installed here, really any custom map that you ever could find or imagine or want to add to a world, any Minecraft world, for example, a single player world, you can add it to an Apex Minecraft server very quickly and very easily. They have in-depth guides on how to do that and even 24 by 7 live chat support. They can help you out if you do run into an issue or run into a snag on adding your world to Apex Minecraft hosting. So nonetheless, if you want an incredible Minecraft server, Apex Minecraft hosting is the way to go. You can check them out at the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and jump right on into downloading and installing custom maps for Minecraft 1.15. Dot two. So the first thing you want to do is download a Minecraft map. Now if you already have a Minecraft map, that's awesome. You can skip forward into this tutorial a little bit to where I'm on my desktop. But for now, I'm going to be downloading some Minecraft maps. And we have linked in the description down below 15 Minecraft custom maps that are updated for Minecraft 1.15. Every single map on this list is updated for Minecraft 1.15. We've actually went through and updated this just last week, getting everything up to date with 15 new awesome maps. So I'm going to download three maps here today. First off is going to be just a uh, funky parkour map. This map is a, you know, sequel to Freaky Parkour, and I've done Tutorials on Freaky Parkour for forever. It was our 1.14 map, so why not continue the trend with Funky Parkour? So we're going to click that green download button, just going to open it in a new tab. We're also going to go ahead and install the Minneapolis in the countryside map because this looks really cool. There's a lot of cool stuff there. It looks really cool. I want to explore it personally. And then we're going to go ahead and grab the Breakout 2020 map, which is another cool kind of like escape map. So we've got a parkour map, an escape puzzle map, and a city town survival sort of map. So let's go ahead and download this one. So once you're here, scroll down, click on that green or that download Minecraft map button there, and it immediately downloads in the bottom left. The Minneapolis, Minopolis, and countryside, Minneapolis. That's an actual city. Minopolis and the countryside here. We want to go ahead and click on that download map there. Now, it does warn that this is a very, very large file. And actually, as you can see, something appears to be wrong. I think that's because that map is so big. I'm sure it'll get that fixed very, very soon. Sorry about that, so we'll skip that one. But then we will go ahead and skip over to the Breakout 2020 map, where we want to go ahead and click on the Download Minecraft Map button there, and that'll download in the bottom left. As far as other maps here, let's go ahead and grab Pixel Party 2. Why not grab this one? I wanted to do three maps, so we're going to grab Pixel Party 2. Let's go ahead and do that. Click on the Download button there, and it downloads in the bottom left. Now we go ahead and minimize our browser here. These unconfirmed things will disappear here in a second. I don't know why, but Google Chrome has been doing that for me recently. It's pulled these weird unconfirmed things up and leaves them longer than they should. These always appear when you're downloading files, but Google Chrome has been leaving them for a significant amount of time. So I'm just going to drag those out of the way. They'll disappear in a second. But we do have three things on our desktop. We have Funky Parkour, we have Breakout 2020, and we have Pixel Party 2. As you can see, all three of these here rocking and rolling on our desktop. And to get started, we want to go ahead and unzip these files. So we're going to right click on each one of them and then click Extract All. So right click, Extract All, and we're going to do this on all of these. So right click, Extract All, right click, Extract All, so on and so forth. Now, if you don't have, like, you know, if these look like books, if they don't look like zipped up folders, that's perfectly fine. Same process, right click, Extract All click extract. Just go down through and do this on all of these and then it's going to open up all of these folders in the background here. That is a big map pixel party. So we're going to let all of these extract, let that finish on up and then once it is we will be able to go ahead and get everything rocking and rolling as far as like actually getting these ready to be installed into Minecraft. There we have it. Pixel Party 2 is now extracted. Now what we want to do is go ahead and delete the zip files we downloaded. These files right here. Yours may be books. They may be seven zip files. Doesn't matter what they look like. Just delete them. You don't need them anymore. Now we've got these on our desktop. So we're going to start off with Funky Parkour here and just double click on it. And then if you see Funky Parkour or anything other than a bunch of files, 
keep clicking. So as you can see, we have this funky parkour profile here. Double click on that, and then here we are. We have data, dim one, dim dash one. As long as you're seeing some of this stuff like data or dim one or region, anything like that, you're in the right place. What you then want to do is click the back arrow in the top left and drag funky parkour to your desktop. Then you can delete the funky parkour file you had or the original map. Now, whatever you drag to your desktop, make sure when you double click on it, you immediately see DIM1, DIM-1, all of those files there. Might not be all of them, but it should be most of them. Then you'll have the next map, right? If you're just installing one map, that is perfectly fine. Now, if a map does have a README, that's probably worth reading. How in this case, it's not going to really change how we install it. So as you can see, we have Breakout 2020 here. We double click on that. Look at that. There's DIM1, DIM-1, region, all of that stuff. Take that Breakout 2020, drag it to our desktop, and we can delete that file that was extracted. And then last but not least, Pixel Party 2. Click on that. Look at that. We have Pixel Party 2. Double click on it. DIM1, DIM-1. Drag that to our desktop. And now we are done. Now, as soon as we open up all of these maps, right, Funky Parkour, we should see DIM1, DIM-1. Breakout, DIM1, DIM-1. And Pixel Party 2, DIM1, DIM-1. Awesome. We are done. These are now ready to be installed into Minecraft. Now what we can do to do that is go on the little Windows icon. For me, it's in the top left of my screen. For you, it's probably in the bottom left of your screen. But click on that little Windows icon in the top or bottom left of your screen, and then go ahead and type in Run, R-U-N. You'll then have this Run Desktop app here. Click on that Run Desktop app, and in here, what you want to do is type in percent sign, APP, DATA, percent sign, percent, app data percent, and hit enter, right like so. It'll then open up your roaming folder here, and in here, you'll have a dot .minecraft folder. Double click on that dot .minecraft folder, and then you will have a saves folder. See that saves folder there? Double click on that, and in here, you'll see all the single player Minecraft worlds you have. You know, for me, I have Nixcraft there, Hardcore, Challengecraft, all that stuff. Right there it is, right? It's all installed, all ready to go. Now what you need to do is take any of the maps that you want to install from your desktop and drag and drop them into your saves folder here. Now once they're in here, they should be installed. But again, we're going to double check one last time just to make sure that when we open them, we see the correct files. So Breakout 2020, double click on it. There it is. Dim1, Dim-1. Uh, funky Parkour, there it is. Funky Parkour has Dim1, Dim-1. And then last but not least, Pixel Party 2, Dim1, Dim-1. We are good. Now we can go ahead and open up Minecraft just like you would normally open up Minecraft, right? Minecraft 1.15.2 there, click on play, it's going to launch right on up, and you're going to play this just like any other single player world, right? It's just going to be located right there in your single player Minecraft, ready to rock and roll. So here we go, loading up Minecraft. Da -da -da -da. There we go, that, that was that, that was kind of a, no, I've got a resource pack on. Let's go ahead and turn this resource pack off really quickly. Boom, there we go. Now let's go ahead and click on single player from the main menu here, single player. And then we have Breakout 2020. We have, where is it at? Pixel Party 2 and Funky Parkour. We'll start off with Funky Parkour here. And as you can see, this world's last play in 1.15.1. That's perfectly fine. We know what we're doing. We can update it to 1.15.2 without any problems. So when we click on that, it's going to join on in. And as you can see, we can click to start. And here we are starting our parkour out. Boom and boom. And there we go. We are we are now parkouring, everyone. I suck at parkour. Anyway, there is that one. What about Pixel Party 2? We can go ahead and double click on Pixel Party 2. Same thing. Last play to 1.15.1. Are you sure? We know what we're doing. We are fine. As long as the map is made for 1.15 or 1.15 snapshot, it's going to work in 1.15.2. So as you can see, selecting rounds, we can add a round, we can remove a round, we can do all that stuff. But we can go ahead and start the game by clicking the button there. So what do we want to do? Do we want to do snow business? Sure. Let's go ahead and click on that, snow business. And yeah, if you wish to reset the map, you can click here. Whoops, you appear to be alone. These mini games aren't supported for only one person. Yeah, so we need to set this up to play with our, like on the land world, you know, open to land and, you know, go ahead and start the land world up to allow us to actually be able to play. But nevertheless, there you have that. That is Pixel Party 2. And then last but not least, we can click on single player here and jump into Breakout 2020. Guess what? We know what we're doing. We're perfectly fine. We can jump on in here. We're going to Breakout 2020 made by Look Mom No Feet. Can you find all 16 apples in the four rooms? Click here to reset the room. So yeah, you can go through here. You can adventure, explore, check everything out, and uh, you know find all of the apples because there are apples everywhere. Apple! Uh, I'm sure you click that. It's probably going to do something. Yeah, there's, there's all sorts of different stuff here. I have no clue where everything's at or anything's at. I'm just guessing. Who knows? I don't know. But yeah, that's pretty much, that's pretty much how that is working. But yeah, 
there you have it. That is how you can set up Minecraft maps in Minecraft 1.15.2. That is everything you need to know. Everything is covered. Everything is there. And overall, I think that is a uh, pretty cool... Wait, hold on. How do you get to this door? I could easily start just, like, playing this this game. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, thank you. Oh, was that an apple? Look at that. That was an easy apple to find. Oh, that's cool. The apple are actually player heads. Awesome. But anyway, there you have it. That is how you can download, install, set up Minecraft maps, custom maps in Minecraft 1.15.2. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below. And if you want to play on an awesome Minecraft server, come play on our network Minecraft server, play.breakdowncraft.com. We have incredible grief-protected survival, custom skyblock with medieval survival, having 30 custom quests and a player-based economy, and aquatic survival, having a slash shop-based shop economy, and a ton of, and an awesome community. Our skyblock server has OP enchants, as well as custom islands and everything is custom you'll absolutely love it so come play with us play breakdowncraft.com is the ip i can't wait to see you online anyway my name is nick this has been the breakdown thank you all so so much for watching and i am out peace